a ghostly shine is predicted to appear on the moon glowing on the edge of the lunar body. A lunar phenomenon called the Da Vinci glow which lights up the unlit side of the moon is expected to be visible from Earth this week and over the coming weekend. It is named after Italian polymath Leonardo da Vinci who explained the phenomenon for the first time in the 15th century. This process is a faint glow of the moon's shadowed dark side due to sunlight reflecting off the earth's surface and back onto the moon. This dull glow is visible only on a slim crescent lunar surface when the moon is close to the horizon during both the last few days and the first few days of its orbit around the earth. During this time, the earth's northern or southern hemisphere tilts towards the moon enabling sea ice and clouds to bounce an exceptional amount of sunlight towards the dark parts of the lunar surface. This sunlight reflected by our planet is termed earth shine and it will render an airy glow to the moon. Earth shine typically becomes most prominent between April and June and is easiest to notice around the new moon phase where most of the moon disappears in the darkness of earth's shadow. For Indian residents, the next new moon will occur around 9:23 pm Indian standard time this Friday or on May 19th. The shimmery phenomenon is also sometimes referred to as ashen glow and will continue to adorn the skies for a few days before and after the new moon. During this time, the reflected light will be about 10% brighter than average. The intensity of earth shine varies in strength over the course of a year as light reflected from the earth varies. The albedo or earth's reflected light is the brightest during the northern hemisphere spring with a slightly smaller peak happening in the southern hemisphere spring. This is because during the spring season in the northern hemisphere, the earth is tilted towards the sun and winter snow and ice are still around. And since snow and ice reflect more light, earth shine is brighter during this time of the year as compared to the winter when the arctic receives very little light from the sun. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.